Inside the core, you have fuel rods containing your nuclear fuel. So this could be uranium containing U-235 inside the fuel rods, where the very energetic splitting of the uranium takes place, and thus energy is created in the form of heat. Around the fuel rods, you have water that gets turned into steam. And this steam eventually goes into a steam turbine, which drives a generator to produce electricity. How is the chain reaction controlled so that the reactor does not become an atomic bomb? The reaction is controlled by control rods that temper how much heat the reactor produces. To shut down a reactor, the control rods are inserted fully into the reactor, which can cease the chain reaction. Now, how do control rods do that? Control rods are made of a material that is very good at absorbing neutrons. So they end up absorbing the extra neutrons that are being produced in the nuclear reaction that propagate the chain reaction. So as the control rods absorb these extra neutrons, there is no way for the chain reaction to continue and the reaction stops. 